Hello guys, uh, I really wanted to continue with the, you know, my series on uh, Google Maps APIs and um, what I'm talking today about is, um, you know, markers, adding markers to your, uh, your map. You see, if you remember from my first video, and you can watch it because it is on YouTube now, you will, you know, notice that um, we don't have any markers pointing to a specific location or, you know, you cannot just, you know, show that uh, you're trying to show your business location or your home or your your basement <laughs> okay so in order to do that we can use markers which you know come with uh, google maps apis so you don't have to you can create your own markers but you can also use this one for free now one thing i should mention is i really want to thank all the guys up there you know ladies and gentlemen who vote you know gave me a lot of uh, thumbs up on uh, Google Plus when I posted that first video so I really appreciate that now let's go do it in order to add in order to add a marker to our map all we need to do is just below the map you know the line here right here after creating our map here all we need to do is come here and say create marker and then we say new google.maps.marker and then we pass in an object like in a dictionary you know normally you can call it a dictionary or whatever you want <laughs> but uh, it has key values okay now this object though takes two properties so this is a marker object a marker class that you can use to instantiate your own object and you need to pass in two property one of the properties is position and this position is I mean it should sound obvious but if it doesn't it it, in, it means where the marker should appear so we just we just need to create uh, another loca a new location here using lo latitude and length lo and longitude uh, class and we pass in the uh, the value so I'm going to pass in the same values here you know but you can pass in whatever you want and uh, so this will actually show up on our map and this is the center of the United States and so comma and then we have the map if it sounds familiar then it should be because this map is the same map that we created here in other words we are just adding this marker to this map because we already have the map so we just pass it in there and then we just complete that now that's it and uh, we should be ready now to test our map and it should be working before that though I want to show you that um, I am using uh, the Apache web server so I, that's where I store my files and if I go to the, this uh, port on my browser it should um, should be uh, listening there and I should see our map okay so let's go ahead and see right now we don't have any markers but let's refresh it oh and there it is huh isn't that cool so you can now actually have a marker showing the location of your business and you can add more stuff but you know that will be for later on tutorials and stuff so i really appreciate this uh you watching this video and uh, please remember to subscribe if you liked it and i uh, hope to see you soon you can go ahead and uh, copy this code if you want i'll make sure that you know it's pretty clear enough so that you can see have a good day and uh, thank you